Hey everyone, it's Let's Talk Monday. I hope you guys enjoyed your weekend and you have a bunch of good things planned for this week. So today I wanted to talk to you all about selecting your lender when you're looking to purchase a home. Um, the biggest thing I just wanna to talk to you about is please keep in mind you know, and make sure that when you speak to a lender, they actually run you through their automated underwriting desktop system. What does that mean? Uh, that means that they're pulling your credit. They're actually requesting W-2s, pay stubs, bank statements, and all that, those documents, uh, standard documents, just to make sure um, that you can, uh, you know, you're approved for the home as far as your debt to income ratio, um, how, how much you actually can, you know, afford monthly, um, and also you don't have any derogatory or anything that would prohibit you from purchasing a home. Um, sometimes some lenders just have a conversation with you over the phone. You give them how much you make, how long you've been working there, what's your credit score, and they don't even run your credit. And they say, oh, here's your pre-approval letter. Go look at that. Go look at houses. Um, and the pre-approval will be contingent on providing that information. So why is that scary? Because you can go and find a home that you really love, um, submit an offer, get it accepted, um, get a home inspection, get pushed through underwriting, um, where they actually finally check all of that information, um, pay for a home appraisal, and all of a sudden, and do your de earnest money deposit and find out that you actually um, are not able to get the home because something possibly could have happened, you know, derogatory marks on your credit for previous foreclosure, um, a lot of mis um, late payments, student loans, whatever it might be, um, all of those things should have, have been ran and checked previously well in advance before the lender issues you the uh, approval letter. So keep that in mind when you're looking for a lender, make sure that they push you through their um, automated underwriting desktop system. Um, that way it gives you confidence knowing that whatever home that you go out and look for, um, you'll be able to get it and don't foresee any issues or red flags on your profile as far as your, you know, credit history, working history, and all that good stuff um, that doesn't come up while you're all the way into the home buying process. You want to find out sooner before you even go looking um, for a home. So keep that in mind. Hope you all have an awesome week. It's Let's Talk Monday.